Hey, what's up guys? It's Jokiko14 here. Welcome back to another episode of Treasure Island Fantasy. How are you guys all doing? I'm doing pretty good today. Um, let's just jump right into things. So the first thing we're going to be doing, well first of all, I'm not even going to bother saying anything else, but we're back to the default texture pack. Um, the second thing we're going to be doing is we have a ton of treasure chests to open up. Like an absolute ton. Like 150 plus these. So, that is going to take up a lot of the intro part of the episode. So the first thing we're going to be doing is, let me find a good place to put that. Let's throw that in there. Let's throw our guide out here. And why don't we just open all these and figure out what keys we're going to get. So, um, yes, welcome back to Treasure Island Fantasy. I'm sorry, this series has gotten kind of neglected, it's fair to say, recently, so... I figured, you know, it, it's something I really do need to come back and do, so that's what we're doing here today. They are still on 1.12.2, so that's the one thing that kind of is a downside, but it's not really the end of the world. Just something to mention. So, still clicking to get rid of all these things. I guess we're making a lot of love in the process. Okay. And, wow. Are you really? So, wow. I only got one boatswain key. That's actually kind of surprising. Okay, then. Um, so, these wooden keys, I'm going to save those. Actually, yeah, I'm going to save those, I think, for opening on my own time because those are not very interesting. The iron keys, the gold keys, I'm going to leave those alone. I will open these ones, though, now. So, why don't we start? I'll go over to warp keys, and we will open up the diamond ones first. So, let's see. We go over here. What's underneath here? I have no idea. Anyway, let's just go on over here and... Okay. Nice, we got some spawn eggs, some armor, pretty typical stuff. Alright. Um, next up, why don't we do our bedrock keys? We got space. Looks like it gave us a uh, boat swing key, that's kind of cool. Uh, oh gosh, chat's freaking out at why I had that many left over. <laughs> I forgot to announce that in chat. Um, well, there you go. That's uh, that's that. We just got a bunch of tools, so that's fine, I guess. Um, so then finally, let's do our boat swing keys. No, that's it. Sorry. All right, so let's do our boatswain keys. Uh, all right, so we got a gamble and a prize key. Um, why don't we do the prize one first? Yeah, I think we got this timeless sword, unbreaking 35, okay. Only wooden, iron, gold. All right, got a crew key. And a crew prize key. Nice. Alright, not too bad. These are actually somehow worse than these things. Okay, so finally, I guess I kind of lied. I suppose this is what we've got here now. we got a pet chest. got a T-Rex pet. I'll just check that out real fast. I don't want to spend the whole episode's... Uh, how does this work? I always forget. Um, okay. Oh my, oh my gosh. Oh, that, that is big. Wow. Um, okay, I guess it's not very practical. <laughs> um, alrighty then. Yeah, I think we're gonna just, uh, disable that. <laughs> and finally, our doubloons chest, 4,000 doubloons. Okay. So that is pretty much everything that's worth opening on camera for you guys. Of course, I'm going to open all the other stuff up on my own time, but I just don't want to waste too much time doing that. I'm going to go put this stuff away, and then we'll go ahead and move on. So we are back here at the the house, and we're going to just be picking out some of these tools real quick to see which ones we want to keep on us. So we've got... I enchanted this pickaxe with the eShop command, so I would prefer not to replace that, even though I should have... wish I could have put it on that. That would have been nice. Silk Touch... Uh, sure, why not? Why don't we use that instead? Um, yeah, and no, I'd rather have unbreaking. Um, let's see, this one's this one's uh, overpowered. We'll go with that. 
So, and then no axe. And the armor, honestly not a big deal. I'm gonna leave it. So, yeah. We'll throw these spawn eggs away somewhere else. I don't know where the best place to put them is, but whatever. We'll just find a good place. Oh, here, up here, that works. Okay. So, what are we gonna be doing now in today's episode? Uh, we're just gonna kinda go through the slime fun guide and see what we can kinda complete. I haven't really looked at things too much, but... Uh, we're gonna go to the basic machines and kinda see what we can do. So, I think these are unlocked with experience levels. So, we're gonna click to unlock. Okay, so it's doing something. Okay. So I've unlocked the grindstone. Alright. Oh. So. It looks like this is a... It's called the... What was it called again? The grindstone. And it's a dispenser and a fence post that can be used to make... Huh. Interesting. Alrighty. I wonder how you make all that stuff. Uh, alrighty. So why don't we get the materials for that real fast. We gotta find a bow. An undamaged... Actually, can you use this? Because I know they changed it. But 1.12, I might see able to use damaged ones. Uh, do I have any sticks anywhere? No, really? No sticks? Okay. Let me use a workbench. And... Wait a sec. No, no, no. Well, I do need fence posts. Where, where's my fence post? Fence post. Okay, there's a fence post. And... I think... Dispenser is cobblestone, right? Cobblestone and maybe a piece of redstone or something? Honestly, I don't remember. Uh... Bleh, 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 there we go. Cobblestone. I'm gonna have to use this because I'm a terrible person. Dispenser. Okay, I need a piece of redstone. Okay. So, let me find a piece of redstone right here and let me go over here put this there put this there and let's see if this works no okay wait a sec oh that makes a dropper never mind okay so we have to make a new dispenser or a new uh, bow rather and i don't have any string hmm let's check the auction house um we got some lucky blocks some terracotta more advertisements i guess this is becoming a thing now uh, this is all whatever that is. Uh, wonder what's in there. I guess, I guess, I suppose you can enchant books now, I think, but well, why would you do that? Because you probably can't even, like, put those on the items. It'll just delete the... Oh my gosh. Okay. Um, I need some string. Oops. Maybe somebody's got string here. I guess we'll have to try these shops again. I don't remember if we tried this in another episode or not, but I'm just looking for something real quick and dirty. Ask him nice. So is it unstocked? Come on, they might have string, right? They might have string. Please. Maybe. Come on, somewhere you gotta have it. No. Gems. I like that spelling of gems. Very smart. Okay. Um. Don't see it there. Don't see it there. And I don't see it there. And I don't see it there. That's kind of surprising, honestly. Mob. Oh, there's more mob drops over here. It's kind of bad. String. Really? Alright. Let me try one of the ones further down. Uh, oh wow, there's actually a ton of these for sale. I don't remember if this was like this before. Hmm. Uh, block shop. Probably not what I want. Well, they might have a spider mob grinder. Oh gosh. Is this the extent of the shop? <laughs> uh, okay. Are these portals? Yes, they are. Are people, like, setting up, like, portals within their shop to other shops or something? Free items. Come on, have some string for me. Really? This doesn't even look like it has anything. Uh, just for some string. I suppose I could have bought a bow from somebody. 
Or I could even just buy a dispenser. What? Oh my. Wow. Hmm. That's pretty cool, actually. I wonder what plugin that is. I love how they just pretty much advertise each other's shops. I, I think that's kind of funny. Come on, one of these guys. What, what is this? Did somebody. What? <laughs> Jeez. Come on, nobody has string. Nobody has any string. I don't think I use player balls. How about this one? Oh my gosh, here we go. Yes, I don't even care if it's $10. I'm gonna just get, yeah, six. Awesome, this is really laggy though. <laughs> Alrighty. Okay, now we finally got the materials. Excellent. So let me just real quick make the bow. I always forget how to make it. And I still don't know how to do it after all this time. Gosh, I don't know why I always forget the bow recipe. I don't know. There we go. Alright, so that there, that there, cobblestone around the edge. So we'll go up here. It says it wants it to face up. That's not facing up. That's not facing up either. How do I... Do I have to really break this just to do this? Alright, face up. And place. And this thing. All right, so it looks like we have, oh, okay. So I guess you can make gravel from this thing. Um, let me go back to the slime fun guide real fast. Let's see. Oh, oh, I think I get it now. I think I get it. I think recipes made in. Do you put the item here and then you get what's on the bottom? I think that's what's going on. I think so. Okay. Okay. So, I don't have any... Uh, let me see. What else... What else could I test it with? I can test it with a bone. Let me see. I'll go grab a bone. And... Let's see what we get. Ah. Okay, so pretty much, it's like it says, it's more efficiency. So that means that you can get gravel from cobblestone, you can craft the flint from gravel instead of having to manually get it, you can get gold from netherwork, gold from Meyer Vendor, I don't know why you do that. Um, obviously more efficient recipes for the blaze rod and the bone. Okay, that's actually pretty cool. Alright, nice. And it looks like it did take XP, so that definitely explains where where these levels come from. So why don't we check out... Let's see if there's some stuff here. Well, this stuff's at higher levels. Why don't we, why don't we try the Armor Forge? Let's unlock that. Alright, so it looks like we're going to need an anvil and a dispenser. So it gives the ability to create powerful armor. Whatever that means. So why don't we do that? We can make another dispenser. Oops. Oh, I gotta use another workbench. This house is not well designed. I'm telling you, this is this was definitely one of my worst ideas I've had in a while. I'm gonna be honest. I'm gonna have to tear this thing down probably and just start from scratch. I've been trying to kind of look up some building tutorials to try and get a little bit better. You know, thanks, Green. Oh, yeah, we need an anvil. Oh, we need an anvil. Oh, we need an anvil, and I think I'm not going to have enough iron. Oh, no, I might just have enough. I might have exactly the amount. Perfect. <laughs> you know, I didn't actually ever realize it. it was that little you needed to make an anvil, so it needs to be facing up again. So we need to put this right here, I guess. Why not? This house is so bad. <laughs> There we go. Okay, so we'll drop that up. So the question is, what are the recipes? All right, so I'm just, well, let me try something. Let me see what I got down here. I have some gold. I was gonna try, come on. 
I'm gonna just see what happens if you put, like, gold in there. We'll just make a helmet. Okay, no, that's not how that works. Honestly, I'm not sure how that works, then. Maybe it, maybe it's, like, slime fun recipes? I'm not sure. Okay, well, why don't we try and see if there's something else that maybe we can unlock. Um, hmm. Not sure. What resources? I just want to see this stuff. Ore crusher. Why would you want iron dust, though? Hardened metal. Hmm. So there's different carrots of gold. Wow, there's a lot of different carrots. There's a lot of different carrots. Percentages. Huh. There's actually quite a bit of stuff in here, I won't lie. Definitely gonna need more experience, though. Um... You know, just for giggles, why don't we try Grandpa's walking stick? Oh, I guess you get both of these. Ah! Nice! So, let's see, just a regular craft- oh no, sorry, the enhanced crafting table. And that gives you a knockback stick, basically. Alrighty then. And then, what's the other difference other than the lower... Oops, what's going on? Oh, lagging a little bit. Ah! Is this one you don't need leather for? Huh. Okay. Interesting choice. So then there's like other sword types. These are all three. I just want to see... Ah. Yeah, so I think basic machines is probably where we're going to want to force... Um, focus. Let's try the composter. I, I guarantee we're going to need another dispenser. Can convert mer various materials over time. Oh, actually we need a uh, cauldron. And this is built in the enhanced crafter. So what I'm going to assume is you put in this stuff and this is what you get. Which would make sense. Hmm. I mean, I'm not sure why this is helpful. I, I don't really know why you'd want to make dirt. I mean, this was Skyblock, I suppose, but it's not. Should we try the sawmill? We're trying the sawmill. Allows you to get eight planks from one wood. Oh, okay. This is now this is something helpful. So this is something we got to build in the world. Now this now I the problem is I'm actually out of iron. Hmm. Well, I think that might be a good project for next episode. <laughs> that is actually going to do it for us. This time, I know this is kind of a weird episode. We were just kind of opening keys and then looking at the GUI, but it it is kind of part of the slime fun thing. So I was trying to just figure it out. I was kind of trying to just learn it on camera. I know it's kind of odd, but that's kind of what my goal was this series. But now that I'm kind of starting to figure out how this works, um, next episode, obviously, we're going to get one of these going for sure, or before next episode even. Um, and then we're going to get to building because, like I said, this house is pretty bad. Uh, it's too tiny and it's just it's awful maybe we'll just kind of think about design concept for this area because like I said there was a good reason I picked this area and I figured you know hey it's in this like valley thing why don't we make this whole thing a base of some sort you know make it really civilized for lack of a better word I think it will look kind of fun but I will have to think about that in the meantime so anyways guys Thank you for watching this video. This is JopyCool14 signing out. And remember, everybody, play Minecraft any bacon. Thanks for watching, and I will see you in the next video.